Hi church, I'm Cammy, and welcome to day five of our Balmy Bible story, Cain and Abel. Our key verse this week has been Genesis 4, 1 to 16. Um, yesterday, we saw how it was through our relationship with Jesus, listening to his word and putting it into practice that we could live a wise life and do the right thing. As we finish this series of devotions on our last day, knowing that God the Father wants us to do the right thing and that Jesus, the Son of God, enables us to do the right thing through his word, let's look at how God, the Holy Spirit, equips, encourages, and empowers us. John 17, 7 says, But I am telling you the truth. It is better for you that I go away, because if I do not go... The helper will not come to you, but if I do go away, then I will send him to you. The Holy Spirit is our helper. He is our guide, our counselor, and our comforter. He reveals the mind of Christ and only speaks the truth. He fills us with the power and the authority, not only to live this life, but to also tell people about Jesus. In order to put into practice the things we hear and read from Jesus on a daily basis, we need the Holy Spirit. The scriptures encourage us to be filled, to seek a continuous overflowing, um, to operate in the gifts and the fruit of the Spirit. Today, spend some time asking the Holy Spirit to fill you, refresh you, and acknowledge that you need him to live a life that pleases God. Church, I hope you have a great day today. Bye.